It is Zane here. I'm gonna leak to you the secrets on how I get the best YouTube intros for free. Let's just go. All you gotta do is go to panzoid.com. I don't know how this thing even exists, but these Clipmaker 2 creations, you can click more and you can search anything you want. We can go to latest. And these are all user-made creations, so you gotta be thankful for them. So all you gotta do is just choose one, open it up. You can click this eyeball to go to the camera view. So really, really beautiful. This is like a top tier intro, I'd say, in terms of like skill. Yeah. Oh, it's so good. So all you gotta do to edit this is go to the objects tab. And in here we have text, okay? So all you gotta do, put your name in it and boom. Now the intro is yours. So this was the absolute ideal situation where it's super easy to edit. Okay, so now we have a more complicated intro. So this seems impossible to edit. Let's break down what happened. So it starts off with these two letters that fly up in the beginning and then it spreads out into this four letter trap. So we're gonna go to objects, and if you look at the text, they're all individual letters because they're animated throughout this whole thing. I'm gonna start off by changing the T and the P to exclamation points, because I think it'll just look better. Now we have to add the rest of our name. On the timeline here, find a good keyframe where everything's lined up. And we're gonna start doing a lot of high level customization. So firstly, let's move these. And then we have these groups for the other letters. So I'm gonna duplicate them and label them a little better. All right, perfect. So now I got all my letters on individual groups. Customize it exactly to what you need. And this is like worst case nightmare scenario for editing a template, but sometimes it's just so good that you need it no matter what. Now, since I'm perfectionist, I'm gonna do the final alignment. Awesome. Now we can grab the entire, entire group <laughs> and center it. And let's see if it's a fail. So I'm basically just going through all the keyframes, editing it, making sure things are lined up. You know, I'm actually just gonna delete these exclamation points. Perfect. So if you wanna save it, just click on this folder, save project, and you have to download the file. And you can return to editing, click on this download button, and we can start our render. Now click download your video. As you can see, it's an MKV. So my secret is to go to cloudconvert.com, MKV to MP4. And you can just drag it in, convert in one second. And now let's see. The reason I need to download an MP4 is just because my Sony Vegas doesn't read MKV for some reason. DaVinci and Premiere usually accept it, but whatever. Hopefully you enjoyed this video though. Now you know how to make your own custom unique templates and edit any of them, hopefully. The final secret is that there's a lot of effects. You can change colors of things. So we can change our glow around to different things. It's honestly really powerful. I don't know how this is free. But yeah, chase your dreams no matter what. I'm going viral. I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.